Love and Thunder, the official trailer, finally here. All right, let's check it out, guys. Kids, get to popcorn now. Cool, back. Let me tell you the story of the space viking, Thor Odinson. He was no ordinary man. He was a god. After saving planet Earth for the 500th time, Thor set off on a new journey. Well, he got in shape. He went from dad bod to god bod. And after all that, he reclaimed his title as the one and only Thor. Oh, spoke too soon. Spoke too soon. Jay? Wow, I like the app. Nice. The old ex girlfriend. What's it been like? Three, four years? <laughs> Eight years, seven months, and six days. Give or take. My, uh, okay. sensing feelings. Well, you're right. <laughs> the only ones who gods care about oh, yes, finally. Just is themselves. So this is my vow. All gods will die. I just want to say that was very, very impressive what you did back there. She's my first bad guy. You never forget your first. You are not like the other gods I've killed. Because I have something worth fighting for. Let's see who you are. I take off your disguise and flick. <laughs> oh, <laughs> flick too hard, damn it! You flick too hard. Oh my god. <laughs> Shall we help him? And eventually, grape. Wow. Yeah. Okay. July eighth. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Dork Entertainment. And that was Thor, Love and Thunder, the official trailer. Finally, we've got the official trailer. I think the first one we could we could say that was probably the teaser, but this is this is much more of a trailer. Um, uh, and it, I've got to say, it looks better. It definitely looks better than what we initially saw. And we finally got our first look at uh, the bad guy, Gore, the God Butcher, in this. So, um, yeah, it looks pretty good. I've got to say. Um, trailer wise uh it was a good trailer has it really got me pumped for the movie i don't know like it's sort of um there and abouts like it is definitely better than the first teaser that we got uh and we do get more dialogue in this which is great um i feel like the look of everything that we just saw in the trailer was spectacular like the look wise it's, it's crazy i love how they started the trailer though uh this is sort of the beginning of the trailer where they've got korg actually telling uh you know the trailer or sort of in a story sort of uh, sense to to the kids um about thor which is it's pretty funny and korg is he's a hilarious ca character and that's a dir director as well so which is uh great to have him back actually um it's got that same vibe as as thor ragnarok and you know in terms of an 80s retro type uh you know with the music and the background and everything um, so I'm digging that, um, but also um, just the, the the comedic style of everything. Um, I feel, feel like we got a bit more here. Um, I am starting to get a bit more, bit more of a picture of what type of movie this is going to be, which is good. Uh, and definitely, I think it's worth a watch. So we'll definitely be checking this out in the cinema. Chris Hemsworth, you know, he's always um, going to be good in comedy. I reckon I, I like his comedy uh, timing and, and sense of comedy that he does. Um, yeah, I'm 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 looking forward to this now. Initially, I wasn't really 100% sold on the teaser, um, but I'm definitely looking forward to this now. And uh, another mention, Christian Bale. We finally get to see Christian Bale's character now. There's been a bit of controversy about you know him not or the character not being comic uh, specific in terms of look. Um, I still think he looks quite evil, and I think Christian Bale. You know, he's a big actor. Like he probably wanted, uh, you know, sort of to be recognised. Uh, you know, in that character, you know, more efficiently, I guess, without CGI or, or, or makeup on his face. Well, there is makeup, but like in extensive makeup where you can't see that it is actually Christian Bale. Um, it's sort of like uh, the example of 
um, I think it was Jean Claude Van Damme who who was in the in in the original Predator. He was actually the Predator, but you'd never know it was Jean Claude Van Damme, right? So he he sort of oh, you know uh, jumped out of that suit and got got out of that movie. Um, but I feel like they've changed the character's look, uh, you know, to show that it is Christian Bale. Um, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing because he's a good actor. But um, I think to emote a bit more, I think they've done that. Um, I think, who knows, eventually, that, like towards the end of the movie, they might actually have him change into that sort of um, comic book style character. Like something might happen and he does change. Who knows? Or he might just stay that way and, um, you know, that'll be the end of it. But it look, I'm definitely excited to see this. It's got Russell Crowe in there as well, we saw, and... and you know, his, his role as one of the gods as well. So that's going to be interesting. And Jane is back as well. And she's controlling, of course, Mjolnir as like Lady Thor. We'll see how that goes. Um, but yeah, look, I, I'm definitely uh, sort of excited to watch this. Uh, probably go check it out anyway in the cinema. It's coming out in July, which is not too far away. Uh, please leave a comment below. Like the video, share it if you can. Subscribe to the channel. And we shall see you in the next video. Or I shall see you in the next video. Peace.